swab the inside of the mouth. 200 victims, men, women, and children in Lancaster County. And then we would place the sample on the slide. Had to endure this last year. That's how many people were um, raped and chose to come awesome. forward. Um, you know, after 14 years, I'm still not used to it. ER nurse Angie Mays takes their clothes and digs under their fingernails. Like this is for an oral assault, for instance. The victim also has to be photographed, oftentimes in compromising positions. The whole exam can take up to three hours. You know, it's all very fresh. And, you know, now they have to tell us essentially a stranger, no matter how compassionate, they're telling a stranger what happened to them. That's why some don't want police to investigate. Officers will keep the kits up to two years. Angie hopes that's the only reason for the backlog. If not, hopefully everything will change and more criminals and will be off the street and our communities will be safer. In Lancaster County, Caitlin Smith, News 8.